Good evening tonight, getting ready for the new school year. That means preparing for those new school times. Good evening, everyone, and thank you for being here tonight for KION News at 6. Middle school cannot start earlier than 8 a.m. Getting a little extra time here. Well, high school classes can start earlier than 8.30 this new school year. KION's Anna Terea live for us at the Monterey Peninsula Unified School District. Anna, how is everyone preparing? It's hard to believe it's just a week away now. Hey, Veronica. Yeah, it's hard to believe that the new school year is just a week away. It feels like yesterday they all went on summer vacation, but MPUSD says they have been communicating with parents to let them know about these new start time changes. And the district says it's been working on these, uh, adjusting its schedule for a while. And the district says that it's been rearranging both its bus and bell schedules. School leaders say the time change could be positive for students' health. And I asked them if they'll feel a difference. Hopefully that later start time will make a difference for us students that are getting to school and having to start learning early in the morning. Of course, a lot of us have working parents that have the same start time for their work, so we might not be getting to school much later, but we do have a bit of a time to adjust. It has the potential to be very positive. I think one thing we're emphasizing is that this doesn't mean just stay up later and, and go to bed even later because you have half an hour more to get to school. SB 328 went into effect at the beginning of this month. Gav Governor Gavin Newsom signed it into law back in 2019. And to see what the new bell schedules look like, you can head to MPUS's website. We'll have a link to that. Just look for this story on our website, KION 546.com. Reporting live in Monterey, Anna Terea, KION News Channel 46.